link to one of his. I swear to God, it was the same. Oh, we're live. What up, John? What's happening? <laughs> Welcome. First night indoor. Feels pretty good. Yeah. If you're in the video, I'm sure we're gonna get a lot of hits. Oh. I will put oh yeah, look at that face. Yeah. <laughs> That's a million dollar face right there. I'm I got a haircut for this video. You're going on the thumbnail, man. <laughs> New profile pic. We got John Bryan shooting oh, that here. One, that, one felt, that one felt pretty good. One of the more commonly known facts about John Bryan is he throws an 88 mile per hour fastball. My favorite fact to share with everyone. And it was never 88 either. You see, I still fucking fabricate that. You told me. No, I never told you. I mean, it sounds a whole lot better than 78 miles an hour, so. We'll stick with 88. I like, that's a better number. It sounds better. Got Eric Flory over here. This guy kills animals. How many animals did you kill this year? Came home empty handed. I got three. Three? What'd you get? I killed a spring bear. I killed uh, a buck and I got a, a catwalk. Oh, what are you building over here, Lindsay? Working do you, on t-shirts. Do you mind? I don't want to be a creep with the, with the camera if you don't yeah. want to be on camera. <laughs> oh, I'm working on Christmas gifts because you know it's one week to Christmas and I'm not finished with any of them. Enough. Lindsay has many talents. You guys watching some Z Nation over there, Miles? Like, what they <laughs> Sharknado. Sharknado. How's it shooting tonight, Eugene? I'm shooting okay. I, mean, I had a couple of mistakes, like that squeaker there barely caught, but it caught. Um, no. <laughs> John, John's doubting that. Pretty good. So what's new with you, Eugene? Not a whole hell of a lot, man. No? It's been working. Any uh, new developments in the world of being a professional archer? Jesus Christ. No, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> Drinking Coke? It was root beer. Ugh. I'm trying to stay away from the caffeine before I shoot. That stuff catches up to you, it that does, caffeine. Dude, it really does. I had a cup of coffee this morning. Yeah, Red Bull for lunch. And Take a lot of pride in John's shooting. Would would you say that you're somewhat one of my students? Wouldn't say, you if say? There's a, if there's a program, I'm definitely one of the first to sign this thing. I, I won't give John a lot of credit because he's fairly new to the game of archery for how advanced his shooting has become. <laughs> but yeah, no, it's um, it's been a process. Uh, let's cut to the chase. Um, this is my first time seeing you since you had some really big news. We are expecting child number three. Yep, John's gonna be a dad again. But, um, <laughs> so congratulations, John. Definitely, I told that camera before I told my parents. So. <laughs> oh, your mom and dad still at home? <laughs> oh yeah. Again. Congratulations, man. Yeah. yeah. That bow arm was looking pretty steady on that shot. I'm trying to get my my indoor eye back. There's like a shade. the most I've ever seen you let down. I'm struggling to get it to go. But root beer is caffeine free. <laughs> yeah, it is, too. It is 300, baby. Whew. Nice. Really? I'm struggling for it. Um, I think I've only shot 15 arrows so far. <laughs> I got here at like 530, though. I didn't even know the doors were open that early. I didn't think they were. I got Taco Bell, and I was going to sit outside and eat my food in my truck. The Chalupa Supreme. Is that your meal of choice? Yeah, that's my go-to, man. Made me sweat on that last one. Dude. I keep it simple at Taco Bell. You get too much stuff going on there, and woof. All right, way to end it strong. I'll take it. I forgot to even grab my arrows last time. We're waiting for the grand total. 46X. That would be a very high X count in my book. Congratulations, Eugene, on another well-shot round. This one right here is one that's really bugging me, but it made it. 
Yeah, that's... Uh, oh, that's it made it. Can we get that 32 times zoom? This is why you shoot 26 13s. <laughs> <laughs> so we, we gotta call it out for what it is. <laughs> I'd like to tell the story behind these arrows because if I'm not mistaken, I shot those ex that exact same group of arrows right there when I was in high school. That was... That is a fact. I'm 36 years old now. <laughs> I'm 32. I sold... Well, actually, they just sat in Dad's shop for over a decade. Then Tyler White bought them. Yep. And he, he shot them for a while, and then he sold them to you. Yep. Those no, arrows have been shot thousands and thousands of times. And I, I like them. They shoot great. Nice. <laughs> uh, for the Triple Crown, I was... You gonna shoot have to the... edit that one out. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime you say that, it's a guarantee it's gonna make it. Damn, that's not a B-roll. <laughs> B-roll. <laughs> ah, I love it. So you planning on shooting the triple crown this year? I am. Yep. What about that uh, that indoor triple crown? That, that looks super fun. We gotta go over there and show those yeah. Washington boys how it's done. It Although sometimes we get over to Washington and they show us how it's done. Yeah. So. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tyler. Oh, you missed a meeting. I know, sorry about that. There we go. I've been trying to get you on film. This is the fastest arrow slinging son of a gun in Hood River Valley. And he hits the and he hits the X every time. Either busy or he's dead. Tyler can shoot three rounds in the time, huh? I can shoot one. He, he literally can. With no stabilizer, usually he has a quiver on his bow too. Do you just take that on and off each day or are you shooting a different bow each time? It depends, sometimes both, yeah. Yeah? Or the switchback. Oh, there he goes again. <laughs> it's for sale, isn't it? It's for sale, there it is. 300 so, shooting machine right there. All right. What's your email address in case somebody wants to get a hold of you and buy that bow? Twgonefishing at gmail.com. All right. I'll put yep. that across the screen. Mr. Right. Sean Bohans, this guy's got a fantastic window business. Yeah. How's the window business going? It's, it's no pains, no gains in the window business. Yeah. <laughs> Well, what's new with you tonight, Dad? Not much. Come here for the meeting. S somebody watched that video of us uh, when I got my new bow. Yes. And somebody had the nerve to give it a thumbs down. Wow. Can you believe that? I can't imagine. <laughs> a couple of guys damn boning it out. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't believe that. Someone had the nerve to give us yeah, a thumbs what's wrong down. With those people. No sense of humor. I think I saw a picture of you with a five-point bull, didn't I? I killed a five-point this year. And you did that with your traditional bow. No, not this year. That was last year. I used traditional. This year he used compound. And my son killed the biggest bull. That was a monster. Um, that was exciting. I was out with him when it happened, but I helped him pack. Uh -huh. Well, you are older now. Not by Tyler can even talk while he shoots. That's an amazing skill. I do want to start missing. Uh -huh. <laughs> we got Shane here. Are you shooting tonight, Shane? A fun fact about Shane, he never misses a day in the gym. I see him at the gym. I, I'll miss. <laughs> I'm in and I'm out. I'm there for a week. I'm gone for two or three weeks. But every time I go, Shane is there religiously. How do you do it? Good shooting, buddy. <laughs> You better check that one out, buddy. All right, we're gonna do a walk up. That's a that's a no stabilizer. Oh yeah. No stabilizer. No hunter. Here's the proof. In with a wrist strap. No fancy stuff. Which draw? Gosh, that is about that's a. That's a 29 inch draw, 60 pound bow. The only thing you could strip off of that to make it more simple is the sight. It's about as basic as it gets. No stabilizer. And I feel pretty confident that we're gonna walk down there and find five X's. There's a good chance of that. Oh, it is looking very 
good. Wow. Look at on a clean target too. Well done, Tyler. Thank you, sir. And Zane is killing it. Kids tell me it's time to leave. Time to leave, huh? Yeah. yeah. But, have I given you a Thursday? I hope so. I will try. Alright.